Hi! So, I am Raccoon Clark. I'm back with a game called Grimm's Hollow. So, this has stuff about grief. So, warning for that. It showed on the screen before that. I, once again, accidentally started the game before I started the recording. Um, so I didn't start on the screen, like, entry screen. Yeah, that thing. So... I have played this all the way through before already, so I think I'm going to do, um... You know what? I'm gonna do this for the story. Or, no. I like the battles. I can't remember what I chose last time. Wake up. Welcome, new reaper. So, we're that girl in the bed. We're so happy to have you join us. It's been such a long time since we've seen a new face. So, we're Lavender. What? Who are you people? Calling the police. I accidentally skipped one. Uh, can we go back? Wait. I don't have my phone. Why is she acting like that for? Krim hasn't given her the lowdown yet, remember? Oh. Good thing we have balloons. Everyone loves balloons. Cats don't. Where are my balloons? Crap. So that's Grim. Everyone, shoot! Ah, Grim, must we? No parties are to be thrown until the newbie is initiated. And no party is to be thrown without me. Especially with my balloons. Uh, come on now, everyone. Out. Eee. I, I can't scream for the life of me. It's because of how my throat is. Hi, Joe! You're back? My cat came back. There'll be cake later. Come here, Joe. So, I can't move yet. So that's why, yeah. I'm sorry if they scared you. They're a bit overwhelming. What is happening? Right. I'll just be straight about it. You're dead. Huh? You're dead. No, I heard you, but why are you here? Well, unfortunately, your spirit isn't strong enough to move on. Here at Grimm's Hollow, spirits such as yourself help deliver ghosts to become stronger. Ghosts? People whose spirit is too strong, making them frenzied and unwilling to go. We reap those, and uh, that's a topic for another time. For now, you need rest. There are fresh robes for you on the bedside cabinet. The local baker has also been kind enough to give you some donuts and cookies free of charge. Unfortunately, we don't have milk. Wait. Do you know where my brother is? Timmy? Sorry, little one. I don't know a Timmy, but if I meet a Timmy, I will tell you. Have a good rest. I can't stay here. This may be some sort of weird cult. I should put on the robe so I can blend in and s escape. Pretty sure the robes look 
exactly like what you're already wearing. Fresh robes, reaper mask, two deathalicious donuts, and three spooky cookies. So, I haven't mentioned this in the other four videos that I've made, but um, I actually have problem with my tone of voice, so I'm not good at controlling it. So, like, when I'm reading stuff out loud, it may seem weird or not right. <sighs> of course. Psst. Hey. I can help you. I saw Timmy in a cave. Cave? Yes, it's where the Reapers go to reap. Oh, God. Don't worry, he was safe the last time I saw him. Where can I find him? Which way? Just go left to exit out of town. Then, head into the first cave you see. You'll find him in there. But do me a favor and don't tell anyone I was here, yeah? You know, these Reapers? They're kind of nuts. I unlocked the door for you. Good luck. Thank you. Reaper starting guide. Rules of the Hollow. History of the Hollow. Death delicious recipes. You don't feel you have the time to read them. This shelf is full of coloring books for some reason. Honestly, despite the colors, they're actually really fucking like me. I'm just trying to look out the window. I've never seen a view like this when I was live. No sun, no moon, no concept concept of time, night, or day. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to freak you out. But, um, so... Basically, the Reapers are really fucking chill and happy people, kind of. So, yeah. Sorry, I don't want to talk. I hate to wake up my partner. He needs to re he needs to restore his willpower. So, woo. Let's talk to this dude. You can't tell whether they're asleep or awake. I can't remember if there's stuff in these drawers. stuff in the room that I was in the can't remember. But yeah, I have played this all the way through. Um, so I got stuff from there. This seems kind of pointless. <laughs> yep, there's nothing. At least the balloons are nice. The yellow ones have smiley faces. Grim's Hollow. And I think that's it. Yep. So, go out. You can talk to these people. Oh, hello. My friend and I were supposed to meet at the bakery and eat some pastries. But I think they've stood me up. Now it's just me and my new friend, the balloon. Oh. <sighs> that poor reaper. Do you want that slice of cake? I'll take it. <laughs> trying to eat a donut. Go away. Hey, broski. I've been thinking. If this is all we eat, how are we able to process all this sugar? Shouldn't we, shouldn't we be fat from all of these carbs or something? Oh, there's no such thing as carbs when you're dead. Now shut up and eat your cake. So, this is the baker. We can shop. We don't have any uh, currency. And. Yeah. Sorry.
sorry, there's no Reapers called Timmy at the Hollow. You can trust me on that. I know all of my customers. Um, who's asking anyway? N no one? <laughs> uh, are you a Reaper? Technically speaking, I am. I don't have enough spirit energy to pass on. But I don't reap any ghosts. I prefer to bake. So call me Baker, please. Um, why is there a bakery here? Reapers don't need to eat to survive, but even if we're dead, we still get tired. If reaping- a reaping can be very draining if it's a difficult one. So I sell bread that restores willpower, which are- which is our health. Which, now that I'm saying that seems obvious, during a reaping. That way, reapers don't fade out of exhaustion. They get to spend more time collecting spirit energy from ghosts. All I ask in return is a small portion of spirit energy, so then one day I can pass on myself. That's the agreement Grim and I made when we were discussing opening up the bakery. Grim's job is, after all, to make sure everything in the hollow passes on. Though really, it didn't take much to convince Grim to let me bake instead of breathe. All I had to do was give him a taste. So, I actually did not talk to him last time, so I didn't know about that history. This cave is void of territorial hazards, safe for all initiated reapers, and this is Ghastly Cavern. Um, as of right now, it's the only place that we can go. That dude's fainted. Uh... This is that dude's friend, partner, whatever. Oi, get up. The Reaper prods his partner with the butt of the scythe. Up, now. Don't wanna. Too tired. That is a mood. North, Waterfall Cavern. East, Ghastly Cavern. Grim's Hollow. South, Death Cavern which is closed. West, nothing special. Yeah, West is into the abyss. Sorry, but cave's clo closed. It's brimming with exploding ghosts, large gaps, and broken bridges. Until Grim finishes restoring it, this area is off limits. And then there's a bunker, which we will be going to later. Please note, this cave is slippery and damp. Take extra caution when crossing puddles. This cave is open to all reapers. I am trying not to make mistakes when speaking now, so... It's dark in here. Guess I'll take off the mask. Timmy, are you in here? Ah! Wow, what a fresh face. You must be the newbie. Uh, yes, I am. Can you help me? If you're looking for another reaper in here, you'll need a scythe. Here, take mine. Thanks, but why? Oh, heads up. Oh, oh yeah, this is our tutorial.
faded away to spirit energy. But yeah, what was that flash just then? That means your spirit has collected some spirit energy. Close your eyelids. So, this is our stats, and we can upgrade. Anyways, I shouldn't hold you up. Go find your Timmy. I'm sure he's missing you. If you ever need any extra help, I'll be around. And don't worry about dying. We're already dead. <laughs> that seems like my sense of humor. If I could laugh about my own death, I would. Okay, so this is like the lowest rank ones, I think. that we can't get to yet. Please note that the ghost caves sometimes have ghost walls. These are illusionary walls which hide secret entrances. You can make them disappear by facing a wall and pressing Z. Try not to get lost, Grim. I heard that there was a ghost wall around here, but I've poked and prodded this wall with my scythe and nothing's happened. Yeah, if I remember correctly... Right there. So, going in. Oh, oh shit. Uh, uh, I think this was the last place I had gone to. out in there. Looks like that ghost you fought gave you a rough time. Remember to eat when you're in danger. Sounds silly, but it works. Yeah, I know. I know. Please. Please don't remind me. <laughs> I know. I know very much. But, um, whenever we enter back in, the ghost spawn, which is nice, because basically endless spirit energy. So, when 
never we always start a fight with zero of the special energy Wow. 
just just nobbing in the middle of the fight. Just don't mind me. so much for finding me. Here's a reward for your trouble. One death delicious donut, one spooky cookie. Once again. So yeah, now that dude should be out there with his friend. Who thought that he was stood up? Um, yeah, those, those poor people. So, once you get that done, I here. Timmy, where are you? Lavender? Is that you? Timmy! Lavender! Hold on! I'm coming to get you! Oh no, you're not. Do you remember me? We met not too long ago at the inn. Well, I wouldn't think you'd care. You just reaped a dozen ghosts like me. Uh, thanks for your help, but I'd like to collect my brother. Collect? That's a nice word for reap. Well, no. I should never have helped you. You're just like the other reapers. I just want to take my brother and go home. Let me through. No, you've done enough harm. You're not reaping him if it's the last thing I do. So now we have to fight Harry. I probably should have upped my stats before this. This is like, I guess, a boss battle of sorts.
when I do that. Bye.